I think Rei Kawakubo is a philosopher. She communicates、uh, with certain words, but quite minimal. And like Rei is your favorite designer's favorite designer. I mean, like her abstract、uh, way of thinking、um, just continues to influence so many brands. And they, and, and it's four or five years later, they'll do something that she's done. There's people that, like Rei Kawakubo, of course, everybody would have to admit that she's an artist. A lot of the aspects that we now take for granted in fashion, like notions of asymmetry,、um, the idea of the unfinished, you know, raw,、um, raw seams,、uh, unfinished edges, were pioneered by Ray in the last、uh, 40 years. So, in a way, she's changed the course of fashion history. I mean, she doesn't give you any detail on on the clothes that what she wants. Rather, actually,、uh, her job is actually to communicate the feel of the of the collection. As difficult as it becomes in the modern era of fashion, when so many have injected themselves into the medium, with the same deconstructionist aesthetic Kawakubo in part inspired, her aspirations to push the boundaries of fashion continue to delight and offend in equal measure. Even if you hold only the most casual interest in the world of fashion, it's hard to deny the fascinating life stories of every renegade we have chosen to showcase in this series. These are the renegades of fashion. <laughs>